Today I have something special for you. In this video I will show you 10 specific launch commands that can significantly enhance your gaming experience. These commands are not just ordinary commands, they are carefully selected based on their utility and effectiveness. They have been tested and proven to optimize your game's performance, making it to run smoother and more efficiently. But what exactly are launch commands, you might ask? Well, launch commands are special instructions that you can set up for CS2 to follow every time it starts up. They can control various aspects of the game such as its resolution, its priority in your system's task manager and even the maximum frames per second that the game can run at. In this video we will not only list these commands but also provide a detailed explanation of what each command does and how it contributes to improving your game. Whether you are a seasoned player looking to gain an edge over your opponents or a newbie trying to get the best possible gaming experience, these commands are sure going to be a great help. So without further ado, let's get started. The first command we got is plus fps underscore max zero, this command removes the default FPS cap in CS2. By setting it to zero, you are allowing the game to run at the highest possible FPS your system can handle. Higher FPS can result in smoother gameplay. No vid, this command skips the game's intro video when you launch CS2. This can reduce the time it takes to start the game. Tick rate 128, this command sets the game's tick rate to 128. The tick rate is the frequency with which the game updates. A higher tick rate can result in more responsive gameplay, which is why 128, the highest possible value, is often recommended for competitive play. High, this command sets the game's priority to high in your system's task manager. This means that your system will prioritize resources for CS2, which can improve performance on some systems. No joy, this command disables joystick support in CS2. If you are not using a joystick to play, this can free up some system resources and potentially improve performance. Plus violence underscore H bullet zero, this command disables blood effects in CS2. On some systems, disabling these effects can improve performance. Soft particles default, this command disables soft particles in CS2. Soft particles are a type of graphical effect and disabling them can improve performance on some systems. Full screen, this command launches the game in full screen mode. Allow underscore third underscore party underscore software, this command allows third party software to interact with the game. And finally, plus SL underscore force preload one, this command forces the game to load our assets on map load, which can reduce stuttering during gameplay. Please note that these are general recommendations and the best settings can vary depending on your specific hardware and software configuration. So yeah guys, thank you for watching, like and subscribe for more videos like this one, see ya!